Hey kids, it's time for another episode of Kitty Cat Gaming with your host, Mortimer! KKG! KKG! Yay! <laughs> hey YouTube, it's Mortimer, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Kitty Cat Gaming. We're back playing more Halloween style games, including today we're playing Alice Return to Madness. Now, I played the original Alice American McGee's game uh, when I was in middle school, I think. And uh, I really, really loved the game. It was super hard back then though, uh, and the graphics were not as pretty as this. So I'm really excited to play this new one. And it's also kind of a special occasion because not only is it kind of like, you know, a very visually interesting game, but it also happens to be the 150th anniversary of Alice in Wonderland, the book. Uh, so this is something to celebrate. So I thought, why not play this game? Uh, which celebrates everything that's in the books. Uh, so, let's start. Alright, so, uh, I already cut the first scene, because I figured you guys didn't want ten minutes of just video. Uh, but basically I was in a therapist room, and they're basically making kids forget memories. Which is weird, right? Uh, and uh, by the way, I love I love this Alice's outfit. She's pretty cute. Can't wait to unlock more outfits. All right, so this is the boys' room. Ollie pinched me smalls. Web Someone Lewis. pinched his. Oh no. Where's that other kid? There he is. Wow, these kids look really disturbing. Oh, there's a drawing of the therapist on the wall. How about that? So, I'm guessing we're in England, Victorian-ish era. Oh, we can't go in through this way? That's weird. Okay. Oh, bit's a mess. Monday's wash day. Monday's wash day. Okay. Children? I'm too old to be here, apparently. What's wrong there? Can't find the door. Okay, can't find the door. I deserve my bitter tears. Want some? Hmm. Oh, these paintings. Not paintings, pictures. I love old timey pictures. There's nothing for us to interact with over here, huh? Top the family again, did you? Muck up the rescue. They died in a mm. fire. I didn't. Bloody dodo. Heads in pieces, no doubt. Ooh, God. Sure nutter you are. These kids talk kind of funny, huh? Home, safe home. The Illustrated News feeds an insatiable appetite for domestic mayhem and industrial disaster. Fire at Match Factory, six girls missing. Is there anything more predictable? The world's gone quite mad. Alright, so it's basically showing us that the world is fucking terrible, but it's not so different from the world we live in today. Ten years in the oh, thank God. The fuck are they talking about? It's okay, I don't need to enter first camera mode. Really? Mr. Payne had no idea how humble a home could be. If not for my drawings and the photographs, this could pass for my room at the asylum. Who's talking to me? There's, there's nobody in here. Is she in here? God. I'm not going to be able to get used to these reverse controls. All right, let's see here. This photograph of my family was delivered here by post. No message, no return address. I'm grateful for the memento, but I wish I could thank the sender. Okay, kind of creepy. Someone sending pictures of your family, but you don't know who they are. Right on. Oh, look, that looks like the Mad Hatter from the first game. Oh, and the mushrooms. Oh, and Tweedledee and Tweedledum. And that looks exactly like... 
the rabbit. Okay, so that was Alice talking. We walked in, and so we didn't see anybody else because this is her room, obviously. These are her memories that she's trying to get rid of. Can we, can we interact with that? It, it, it's glittering like we should be interacting with it, but we can't. Okay. Oh, look at that. Oh man, all kinds of Alice references in those drawings. Hmm. Not being able to interact with stuff's kind of weird. I don't like it. What's that on the floor? Another drawing? It looks like Cheshire. Alright, well, that was this room. It's kind of eerie feeling here, huh? Kids' mental asylum. Right on. I feel like I should be able to interact with stuff. someone out there playing the violin. World's smallest violin out there. Alright. What are these kids doing, huh? Yo, this pet. Too good for the asylum. Mad as a hatter without the charm. Killed her family. Who'd want her? You guys are straight up mean, dude. Why are these kids so mean to me? dust in the air. Is a mold? These kids are gonna die from black lung. Alright, let's... I... What am I supposed to be doing right now? I don't... I don't know. I want something to latch out at me as something to interact with, but so far nothing is. Okay, you're not gonna say anything to me? That's cool. Man, there's no electricity, so they're still using gas lights, huh? Ooh, this is a bunch of cool looking stuff. Abandoned toys and worn out shoes of a past, and the people who use them, too. My past was consumed by fire. I get it. I already know that, baby doll. What am I supposed to be doing? Looking outside, nothing, okay. Oh, God, what was... I look like my shadow was someone hanging themselves. Maybe I'm crazy, I don't know. It, it fucking, it looks like I should be interacting with something here those chests. Oh, the door's open now. What the fuck? Another day, a different dream. Perhaps. Hi kid. What's up with you? Oh, this thing is killing me back. I call work noble <laughs> bastards. Can't come this way, love. Uh, go back. Morgate St Street Station closed. Nice, I think you could build a flat on it. Yeah. All right. Machine made corsets. Ooh, looking at pictures of ladies, I see. Okay, so this is. Houndstitch home for wayward youth or Angus Bumpy prop. Oh, Dr. Angus Bumpy prop. Whoa. Uh, I, I see. I see. Oh, wait. Okay. You like Boccarini, Missy? 
How about Pagan? I don't know what those words mean. Are, are the kids from the Wayward Home just allowed to leave? She ever work? Where's her flat? Too good for company? She don't get close. Hates being touched. Who likes it then? Never slapped, spiked, or like. But an emporium. What the fuck is wrong with these kids, man? The Sandman's coming in his train of cars, with moonbeam windows and wheels of stars. So hush, you little ones, and have no fear. The man in the moon plays the end. You're facing the wrong way, little girl. Oh god. So it's a little spoopy. Whitechapel Market. All right. Now we're getting to the adult stuff. What's up, ladies? Oh, you do not look nice. Notice me. Look at that cat. Could it be Cheshire? Hello, puss. Puss, 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 puss. Don't be afraid. All right. Well, I guess that's our proverbial white rabbit. Apologies to anyone who's getting freaking motion sickness no, from my playing. Going? This camera is not ideal. All living things die eventually. Still, the creature's remains are always poignant. Okay, well. It looks like it's a horse. Where'd the cat go? Well, he led me here for a reason. And he's gone. So I guess that was that. Can't see shit. Whoa. Okay, so uh, I guess I, I do have to find the cat. Oh, he went this way. Oh my god, I feel so dumb. All right, come on, cat. Let's get this shit done. Like a real dog, no changing nappy. You look like a discerning gem. Seems following furry creatures into dark holes has become a habit. I hope it's not a vice. Oh, oh god, it's a fucking Jabberwocky and he looks like hell. Totally creepy. Oh, just just a bunch of Jabberwockies, you know. My stars and garters, Alice Little. Slumming again, are we? Nurse Witless. What luck. Twice in as many months. Out on your own? You look frazzled, dearie. Not doing well? Not really. Come along home then and look at my pigeons. Pretty birds. Like you. I don't think so. Our last visit cost me several pounds and got me nowhere. I might recall where your mangy rabbit got to. Still a mess. No surprise. Her kin roasted like chestnuts right before her eyes. Ten years in Rutledge Asylum wasted everyone's time. Dr. Bumby won't do better. Still hauling out her questions. This art style is fire, amazing. Her memory. I deserve consideration, don't I? Who found her her new clothes? Who got her a place at Bombay's? Where'd she be without me? On the street, selling her backside. Ooh, like some <laughs> pigeons, though. She's doled out the odd pound or two. But what I know is worth more than that. 
kept her secret, haven't I? Heard her say, all died on my account, I couldn't save you. I've told her my silence is for sale. Cheap. I'm a good sort, really. Not like her nanny, that uppity whore. Or that lawyer fellow Radcliffe took her stupid rabbit. Need money. Warned her I'd tell the coppers if she didn't make a donation to my upkeep. She yells and goes off her head. Does she kind of remember her name? What I heard. Hmm. So this lady's pretty good at blackmail, apparently. Alright, well... I mean, I don't know if we have a purse and how much money we have. But I bet Holly would love this part. Alright. Where is she? Where are you at, Mama? A coop is really just a cage, but the birds don't seem to mind. No, I seem, uh, I seem uh, pretty happy. Some of them are out of their cages. Alright, well... Frick. I'm up here, but now what? Fucking looks terrible. I don't think you should be breathing the air out here, Alice. Very nice. There she is. Nurse Witness, do you mean to harm me? To send me back to the asylum? I won't say no. I've a first you could photograph. Need a drink? Your mouth needs washing. Oh god. Uh, uh, uh. And we're going to Wonderland. Ladies and gentlemen, it has happened. Break containers to find roses for health and teeth for weapon upgrades. All right. Look how pretty. Back in Wonderland again. Compared to the real world, this place is fucking heaven. Very upsetting journey, but I'm rid of Pris or whatever she's become. At least the place I've landed is somewhat familiar. About time. Oh, it's our friend Cheshire. Blasted cat. Don't try to bully me. I'm very much on edge. Perfect. When you're not on edge, you're taking up too much space. You're no help at all. But you know I can. I'll frighten myself. When necessary, thanks very much. I was hoping to escape from all that. Abandon that hope. A new law reigns in this wonderland, Alice. It's very rough justice all round. We're at risk here. You uh, be Oh, dang. Your guard. Trouble in Wonderland again? You don't say. All right. Well, next time on another episode of Kitty Cat Gaming, we're going to play The Veil of Tears. Uh, please be sure to hit that subscribe button so you guys don't miss it. And I'll see you guys all next time. Bye, everybody.